Hello guys, welcome back to Target Study YouTube channel. Today I'm going to talk about one of the most in-demand careers in the field of medicine, which is basically opted by a woman as it deals with the female reproductive system, but also a good career option for male candidates. Yes, I'm talking about one such specialization in medical field, and that is gynecologist. If you are the one who is interested or planning to become a gynecologist, then this video will be of a great help to you. Because in this video, I'm going to tell you about this profession in detail. After watching this video, you will get to know about various aspects of this profession, like who a gynecologist is, what are the eligibility conditions to become a gynecologist, skills required to become a gynecologist, and how to become a gynecologist. Besides this, you will get answers to your obvious questions about this profession, which will be there in your mind after becoming a gynecologist. Like, what are its career prospects? What is the average salary of a gynecologist? And much more. So let's start with a very basic question. Who is a gynecologist? Gynecologist is a medical practitioner who specializes in women's health with a focus on the female reproductive system. They deal with a wide range of issues, including obstetrics or pregnancy and childbirth, menstruation and fertility issues, sexually transmitted infections, hormone disorders, and others. In short, we can say that gynecology is a study of women and gynecologist is the one who is expert in the study. What are the eligibility conditions to become a gynecologist? To become a gynecologist, you need to have MD or MS degree in gynecology, five and a half years MBBS course after completing your 12th class with physics, chemistry and biology subjects is a basic requirement to do master's degree in gynecology. Which skills are required to become a gynecologist? Besides their medical background, gynecologists should have certain personal qualities, both emotional and physical, to get success in this field. You should have good communication skills to interact with a woman at this crucial period in her life. You might also need to take on the role of counselor and confident to some of your patients. A gynecologist should have skills to adapt the conditions where he or she has to work in irregular hours with sleepless nights because babies arrive at all times. Although you might have colleagues filling in for you, at times patients expect you to perform their crucial duty yourself. They want to be in trustworthy, familiar hands during the birth process. Along with it, you must carry confidence and have ability to take appropriate decisions at crucial moments in the treatment process and handle all kinds of cases with calm and composure. How to become a gynecologist? To become a gynecologist is not an easy task. You have to study hard for about nine to 10 years, right after clearing your 10th class. As a first step towards your goal of becoming a gynecologist, you need to take physics, chemistry, and biology as your main subjects in plus two. After completing your 12th class with PCB combination, you need to get admission to some good medical college to complete your five and a half years MBBS course. For getting admission to MBBS course, you have to get good rank in NEET UG exam, which is taken by NTA for providing admission to MBBS course of most of the medical institutes in India. AIMS MBBS entrance exam and JIPMER entrance exam are the other reputed medical entrance exam taken by the respective medical institutes to provide admission to their MBBS course. All India Institute of Medical Science, New Delhi, Armed Forces Medical College, Pune, Government Medical College, Punjab, Mahatma Gandhi Institute of Medical Sciences, Maharashtra, and Government Medical College, Kerala are among the some of the most reputed MBBS colleges that you can think of joining for your MBBS course. After completing your four and a half years MBBS course, 
and one year long compulsory internship you need to do masters in gynecology again for getting admission to ms or md in gynecology you have to clear neat pg entrance exam that will help you get admission in md or ms course some reputed pg medical institutes like aims and pgi conduct their own entrance exams to provide admission to the PG course. After completing this three-year specialization in gynecology, you are eligible to join some hospital or clinic as a gynecologist. What are the duties of a gynecologist? A gynecologist duties includes diagnosing the patients, basically pregnant women and their newborn or yet to be born babies, and identify their problems from the diagnostic test conducting research and examine the symptoms to give proper medication and dosage assistance to their patients. Provide all type of consulting help related to women's reproductive system. Maintain reports of the patient that can help them in future treatments and refer patients to other specialists in the case of disease which is related to some other medical problem. Providing healthcare assistance to the pregnant woman in prenatal, natal and postnatal care, performing surgeries in the case of chronic and serious reproductive disorders as well as during delivery if necessary. A gynecologist is the whole and soul of the entire delivery process and also provide healthcare tips for the babies. Besides these duties, a gynecologist conduct conferences and seminars related to health management and dietary plans for women and more. What are the career prospects of a gynecologist? Increasing awareness about the pregnancy among the masses has increased the demand of gynecologists many folds. Most of the women, irrespective of their beliefs or social status, have started referring gynecologists from very starting period of pregnancy and this has broadened the scope for gynecologists. Due to this increased demand, qualified and experienced specialists can find job in nursing homes, hospitals and pharmaceutical companies with an ease. Skilled gynecologists can work in private as well as in government hospitals. Several top medical universities or institutions also offer jobs to such professionals as faculty members. One can also open his or her own clinic where they can practice their domain and treat people. So we can say that there are brighter career prospects for gynecologists not only in India but also in the developed countries. What is the average salary of a gynecologist? After you begin working as a junior or associate gynecologist in a hospital, you can expect to get anything between rupees 40,000 to rupees 60,000 per month, depending upon your caliber and the medical institute you have joined. However, after getting some experience and expertise in the field, you can expect to get as much as rupees 1 lakh to rupees 2 lakhs per month. There is no limit of earning for the established gynecologist who are running their own clinics. That's all from this reputed and in-demand profession. I hope we are able to answer most of your questions about this profession in this video. If you like this video, do hit the like button. To get unending stream of more such informative videos, do subscribe to our Get Study YouTube channel. And to get regular notifications, hit the bell icon. Thank you for watching.